Hey there, I'm Arka, I'm with Skyline Scaffold. We've been around for about 27 years. We're a single branch company, about 75 people in all. We do a lot of Vancouver's uh, large civil and infrastructure projects, focusing on specialty work, seismic, restoration. Now we're always looking for new technologies that will help us become safer and more efficient in the field. Hence the reason we're working with Kawazo on this project. This behind us is a roughly 100 year old church undergoing a significant seismic project. And we're taking down a, a scaffold around a bell tower right now, which is just under 30 meters in height. This is very tight here. We have limited space. There's only one logical plate for a track. But putting two or three separate tracks where you can actually just move the carrier itself, which takes minutes, that would be, I think, one of the big advantages. I've been in, in doing scaffolding for uh, 13 plus years now, but never anything that has this type of technology and sensors and safety factor uh, brought into play. It doesn't take much room. It's very small, compact. The track itself is folds and flaps, so when you get it onto site, uh, you get the base set out, level it, and then you build the track. This is by far the most advanced hoist I've seen. So setting up was real quick, real easy. There was three of us doing it in total, one on the ground, two above. Everything went real smooth. I think it only took a couple hours. Uh, very pleased with how it turned out, to be honest. It was very easy. It's a lot safer as well with the rope winch. And if there's wind going on, it might be decks flying in the wind or ledges flying in the wind. The hoist here, it's, everything's secure, everything's safe. It's very fast. It's really intuitive, everything's self-explanatory, um, and then when the, when the instructor tells you how to use it, it's pretty much the first time you can understand how to, how to use everything, use the controls and how to set it up. So as a worker, two thumbs up from me, yeah, 100%. We've moved into doing a lot of the work that requires R&D, innovation, really solid project management, and a lot of high value engineering. Especially on large volumes, safety is everything. We all know that. The more efficiently and safely we can get material up and down off the project, especially where it's busy or downtown, there's a lot of traffic, pedestrians, it's a win-win. It's